つつりくつつつ
weather. Now, on to the sky cam. Here we are at our sky cam. We have partly cloudy skies. It's a little chilly, so you might want to wear a jacket. The sun is out. And yeah, you might just want to wear a jacket. And it'll earn it or that's the sky cam onto the radar. Let's take a look at our Michigan radar. There are no showers at the moment, but the state is still coated in a layer of clouds. Now, if we take a peek at our Florida radar, Hurricane Ian is swirling itself apart and spilling showers towards the Bahamas and unraveling its more powerful storms northeast into the Atlantic Ocean. And now, on to this day in history. Thank you, Isabel. Welcome to this day in history. <coughs> 7 in motion by the Balfour Declaration of 1917, the British mandate for the establishment of a Jewish homeland in Palestine was finally approved by the Council of League of Nations and came into force September 29, 1923. Also, Discovery was launched from Cape Canaveral, Florida, marking a resumption of NASA's space shuttle program, which had been suspended following the Challenger explosion in 1986. This launch occurred on September 29, 1988. Also, American jurist John G. Roberts Jr. was sworn in as the 17th Chief Justice of the U.S. Supreme Court. Now, I will send you to Kitty Corner, which will send you off to the end of the newscast. And thank you for watching.